Hi everyone, I'm Thomas Hermans and I'm the program manager for the Billion Molecule Against COVID-19 Jedi Grand Challenge. In stage one, we want teams to screen at least a billion compounds with three independent methods. And teams need to start from the best possible protein targets. Depending on the method that was used to resolve the 3D structure, the resolution of the protein might be different. We therefore highly recommend that you check out these three resources. On InsideCorona.net you can read about the work of the Coronavirus Structural Task Force and how they go from raw data to the best possible protein structures. Our colleagues at the Molecular Sciences Software Institute are curating a hub where they provide targets, proteins, structures, models and simulations. So check that out. And last but not least, our partners, Folding at Home, are looking at the important COVID-19 proteins and discovering new cryptic pockets that can be targeted. In order to screen more than a billion compounds, first, teams have to make the largest possible chemical compound library. We recommend starting from the Zinc 15 library, including the Sweet Lead library, and also CAS has provided a library of 50,000 antivirals. Unique to the Jedi Grand Challenge is that our partner Merck is making available one of their libraries for drug discovery, which can be obtained through us. All this information can be found on the resources page of our website. But first, please register your team. This can be done at any time until the deadline, which is the 3rd of June at 5 p.m. Central European time. And please sign up for our exchange platform, which is a Discord server where we can directly communicate with the teams and with the program manager. After the 3rd of June, when all the teams have submitted their lists, and just to remind you, each team has to submit three lists of 10,000 compounds for one specific protein target each, we at Jedi will then cross-correlate all these lists of all the teams for a specific protein target. We will then make an ultimate list, which is consisting of 10% of cross-correlated compounds, so compounds that are found on lists of multiple teams, and the remaining 90% of this ultimate list will be composed of compounds that are top ranked for each team's list. Our partners will then turn this ultimate list into a physical compound library as a DMSO stock, which will then be screened against recombinant protein to obtain the dissociation constants. Based on the obtained KD values, we will assign a score to each team, which will be the number of compounds times one over the dissociation constant. The team that then has the highest score will be awarded 250,000 euros. So please go to our website covid19.jedi.group and sign up for the challenge.